All right, guys, I can't lie, all right? I've been cheating on a minoxidil beer journey, man. I've been cheating, all right? I've been cheating, and I'm about to put you guys on game, all right? With no further ado, let's get to it. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Unbreakable Grind. It's your guy, CJ, back with another minoxidil beer update, man. So I've been cheating on my journey, all right? As you can see, I got the gains going crazy. I've been doing this for two months. This is my two month update. The gains are going crazy. I literally, this is where I wanted to be. If this is my seven month goal. I wanted to be here in seven months. Like when I first started, this is where I wanted to be at month seven. You know what I'm saying? I'm already here at month two, all right? Just completed month two. So with that being said, guys, Check out the games. Let me let you guys see this. And then I'll let you guys know how I've been cheating. All right, so as you can see, I look crazy. It's just looking crazy. I look insane. It's almost like I, I, I've got a mature beard already. And I got some cheat codes loading. You know what I'm saying? I've been, I've been implying a, a little cheat mechanism. So check it out. As you can see, that's my good side right there. Let me focus on the eyeballs. Uh, all right, see that? Mm. Man, that look, that's, that's a cold look. <laughs> Man, that's a cold look, I can't lie. All right, let me try to focus on the eyeballs. I can't see myself to see what I'm looking like on this one, but we'll see. You guys can, you guys know the deal, man. I do this every time. When I show this side, I barely can see it myself. So with that being said, as you can see, I've got some fullness on that side too. I'm looking good, man. I'm looking like I got a mature, a mature beard coming in. It almost looks like I have a mature beard that grew out and I just shave it down. You know what I'm saying? You can't tell that I just started growing all of this crap two months ago, literally. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So with that being said, guys, uh, the minoxidil journey is going great. My process right now is my applying the foam minoxidil one time a day. Yep, I'm already getting lazy. I'm, I'm applying it once a day. I should be applying it twice a day, but the results are so good. Let me be honest, man. The results are so good that I'm getting lazy. I'm getting comfortable. And that's why I preach on my channel. If you go check out some other videos, this unbreakable grind type of, uh, type of, a, type of approach to life, because if you get comfortable, you will get lazy. And I just got lazy, man, literally. I'm like, ah, I don't know, I don't want, I'll, do, I'll do once a day because why not? I already got, I already reached my goal. You get what I'm saying? So I'm gonna step it back up to twice a day just so I can see where, I, where I'll actually get by month seven. So today I applied my minoxidil midday like I usually do, and I'm about to apply it again before I go to sleep. So that's what I'm doing. I'm back on what I've been doing for the last week or a week and a half, once a day before I go to sleep. I wipe it off in the morning and I, I moisturize. What I'm gonna go back to doing, which is what I did all the way up the first month and a half, is I was doing, mid, uh, I would do it at night, I apply the minoxid minoxidil, sleep in it, wake up, moisturize, at 12 p.m. in the middle of the day, I would jump right back in, wash my face, minoxidil up again, let it dry for a, a, about three hours, moisturize up, and at midnight, I'm, or before I go to sleep, I'm right back at it, minoxidil, go to sleep. Okay, every three days to four days, I would derma roll the beard. You get what I'm saying? Now, the derma, the, uh, derma, no, the, the derma roll strategy that worked the best for me, man, was to derma roll before the minoxidil. All right? I don't know. I, I, don't, I wouldn't. This is what I did. It made sense to me. You know what I'm saying? I would, uh, I would wash my face with a warm towel to get my pores open. I would then use the uh, derma roller to create the micro punctures in my skin and then I'll come back with the uh, the minoxidil and it absorbs better you can literally feel it stinging a little bit uh, that might not be good but hey it worked I, to me the act of that that actually I actually saw the growth actually accelerate doing that you get what I'm saying I was a little scared at first because the burning sensation makes you feel like you're doing something that's probably gonna have side effects but honestly I saw the growth maximized when I use the warm towel open my pores first, and then with the open pores, I used the derma roller, and then applied the minoxidil on top of the derma rolled skin with the pores open. You know what I'm saying? I think I maximized the absorption. At least that was my experience. So that's what I've been doing the entire time. Now, to explain the thickness, okay, I've got a, 
a level of thickness that you should not be able to obtain in two freaking months. You just shouldn't. You know what I'm saying? You shouldn't be looking like you've been, like you freaking had a beard your whole life. I, I mean, I almost look like I've had a beard for years. And I, I swear to you, I hadn't had this until two months ago when I started using the minoxidil. So here's the cheat, guys. To, with no further ado, all right? What I've been doing to cheat is beard dye. <laughs> all right? I've been applying beard dye to the beard to maximize the fullness, okay? So here are the hairs on, right around my mouth area on the, on the jaw. The hairs are a little more balanced. They're not as thick, you know what I'm saying? They're not as terminal yet. They're a little more furry looking. So what I do is I, I dye only the, uh, the smaller, like more terminal hairs around this area. I apply the dye here, I apply the dye here, and I apply the dye right around the bottom so that I can kind of, as you can see, I don't grow. Some people grow the beard in all of these areas. I'm one of the people that don't. I apply minoxidil here, it just doesn't grow there. You know, so that's genetics. But I apply the minoxidil here just so I can, I mean, I'm sorry, I apply the dye here so that it can look like it's a little higher. You get what I'm saying? And as it grows up, I see little hairs growing in, it looks like it's going, it's getting there. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, guys, I've been using the beer hair dye and that's how I've been cheating my thickness. All right, that's been making me look like I have a more mature beard than I actually do. Uh, and it's been working wonders, man. You know what I'm saying? I can see people, I can see people staring at the beard, bro. In the comments, tell me, tell me how I look. Do I look better with the beard? You know what I'm saying? Like, do you honestly think like, yeah, bro, I can tell, I can tell you getting the chicks. No homo, right? We, we can, dudes can tell when other dudes get chicks, bro. So you could be like, hey, yeah, that beard, you look better with the beard, bro. You killing it with the beard. You get what I'm saying? Drop your comments, do I look better with the beard? Also, let me know if you're gonna dye your beard after knowing this, all right? So if you've been on Minoxidil and, you've, uh, and you're, you're seeing the Valis hairs, let me know if you're gonna try dyeing your, your beard. And if you're gonna try dyeing your beard, let me know how it goes, man. I'm pretty sure you're gonna get addicted to the hair dye uh, because after I saw that I, I freaking have a full beard with it, it feels weird to go without it. So now I'm addicted, now I'm hooked. So now I'm dying, my, I'm, I'm dying to beer once a week just because I wanna maintain the thickness. And I still do the same minoxidil routine, but I like that thickness. I like to walk around already having the end, end result. And it just, I like that, man. So with that being said, guys, hop on the hair dye if you wanna get that thickness, that fullness early, so you can go out here and be living your best life with the beard looking perfect, bro. With that being said, guys, uh, that's my uh, that's my two month update. I'm gonna have to get out of here and try to shoot some more videos, man. So if you're interested in some of my other content, I've got content coming about financial freedom. Uh, I'm, I'm literally giving you guys the strategies I use to get financially free. Very important stuff. Self improvement, which is some of this beer stuff. How do I get my teeth white? How do I freaking work on my physique? How do I actually build my, you know, build my, uh, my posture? How do I, just everything about self-care in general that's gonna give you the advantage in life. Uh, I'm gonna have a lot of that stuff coming. And just straight game that uh, we can use as uh, developing young people to actually uh, win at life and make life a lot simpler. Okay, I'm kind of giving all my secrets away so that I can help someone else. And uh, I think that's what the cycle needs to be, man. We need to be, we need to be, as you guys win, you need to give back. All right, give back give the game to someone younger and you know they and the goal is to make one a younger person or someone else better than you uh and you that's just the that's the cycle of life man you know what i'm saying we're not going to be here forever and it's better to give back and create a community than to try to be selfish and then die alone all right so with that being said guys love you guys got some more heat coming if you like this content please subscribe uh, I've got great content coming, man. Uh, and I, this is something that's, that's passionate. For, this is something that's a passion of mine. I really like giving back. Uh, I spent a lot of time in my younger years really trying to find all the secrets to success. I found them. They're straightforward. They're right in your face. I'm just giving you the validation to know that you don't have to, you don't have to question yourself, man. I'm here to say, hey, look, I see I have done these steps. You can do these steps too. You can win too. And with that being said, guys, stay strong. Keep growing the beards out. Keep doing everything you can to empower yourself. 
all right because the more you love yourself the more others will love you it's as simple as that the more attractive you are to yourself the more attractive you will be to others the more successful you see yourself and the more disciplined you are for yourself the more success you see in this world and with that being said which i've said with that being said five times already but with that being said one more time i'm out of here peace guys love you guys and uh holler back at the next video <laughs>